So in this session, we are going to find the sample mean, sample standard deviation, and sample variance of the set of sample data collected here. So uh, to use your calculator to do it would be very, very uh, quick and easy to begin. Let's click on stat and edit. Right. So once we click on it, we can choose any of the six uh, spaces of lists here to enter our data, but uh, we can always stick to the list one here. So we enter two, four, six, eight, and ten, and just keep on pressing enter after we enter the digits. Now we are done, we just ask uh, the calculator stat to go to calculator, calculations, and we pick one variable statistics because we have just one random variable here. So we just click enter and tell the calculator that our data is found in list one. For frequency list, if there is anything here, press clear or delete to clear the frequency list. We have an explicit listing of data where repeats are permitted and um, will, rec will be recorded and entered as such. So if we have two observations of uh, two, then we'll enter two and then two and then four, six, eight, ten. Right, so there is no frequency list in, the, in our case. We leave it empty and your calculator then knows that it will count the sample size by counting the number of numbers in L1. So here we enter enter and out comes the, the statistics. So we just copy from the screen and say that the sample mean has a value of 6, the sample standard deviation has a value of SX here, 3.16, uh, 1623 perhaps to 4 decimal places, and what we want is S squared. Now, we'll be tempted to retype 3.1623 here, but we really don't have to. We just use the ver uh, variable button here, and then we will, for statistical analysis, always choose 5. So it's almost automatic. Click bars, then 5, and we then see that there is a number 3 here. You either press 3, or you click on the down arrow to select SX. That's sample standard deviation, and if we square that, Right, and then click enter, and that is our sample variance. Right, so um, just to verify for sample variance, what is our sample variance? That's 1 over n minus 1, sum of all the values from 1 to n, uh, xi minus the mean squared. Right, okay, so our n is 5, 5 pieces of data, so we have 1 over 5 minus 1, uh, sum from x1 is 2, 2 minus 6 squared plus 4 minus 6 squared plus 6 minus 6 squared, that's 0, plus 8 minus 6 squared plus 10 minus 6 squared. And you get the idea, it's very cumbersome, even just for 5 numbers, right? So we have 1 over 4, here it's negative 4, um, and then you square it is 16. I'm just doing a bit of mental calculation. If you use calculator, actually it's more cumbersome. Negative 2 squared is 4. You have 0, and then you have 4 again, and then you have uh, 16 again. So here if you press calculator, it's going to be 32 plus 8, that's 40. So 40 divided by 4, you get 10. So that's correct. Yeah. So we have arrived at our results amazingly quickly just with the clever use of one variable statistics.